Hi, it's Hans at happierman.com. Today's topic is keep after it. Well, what I mean is, when I say keep after it, is you've probably got some things in your life that you need to do, but you haven't done. And these aren't, these things that you're procrastinating on are necessary to the quality of your life. Now, you have to differentiate between what's necessary to the quality of your life and what isn't. Because sometimes there's good reasons for the procrastination. It's, it's something telling you that you don't really want to do that, you, that it isn't right for you. So you, you, gotta, you have to know yourself uh, and know what's good for the quality of your life and what isn't. But let's just assume that these things that you need to keep after are you've determined that that's what you should be working on it's good for your short-term and long-term happiness and your and your goals so you got to keep after them right so let's just say when I'm discussing things with my kids uh, I'm kind of always after well, what is that they, they need to keep after and what should they Oh, you gotta do some effort to get that taken care of and, and behind you so you can work on the next thing. Because this is, frankly, this is how life is. There's gonna be all kinds of things that, yeah, you really don't wanna do. You just as soon uh, lay around and do nothing. But for your long term well being, you've gotta kinda do them. So keep after them, figure out what those are. Put them, write them down in your planner book. Schedule the time. Make sure you do them. Make sure you've allocated time. You know, sometimes you'll say, well, it should only take me five minutes. Well, usually these things that you procrastinate on are going to take you a lot more than five minutes. It'll probably be five hours, five days, five weeks, five months. That's what makes them so blasted hard is they take a lot of time. So start allocating that time. If you got some car repairs, yeah, they're expensive, but how are you going to live without a car, right? Why do you always want to buy a new car when your old one is still running and you just need to spend two, three, four hundred thousand on it? It will, that's still a lot cheaper than buying a new car. So take care, keep after it. Make those repairs. There's gonna be repairs on a new car too. There's gonna to be maintenance. It's gonna be a lot, very expensive. So make the repairs, keep after them. If you're schooling, if, you're, if there's some sort of training or schooling, you're gonna to have to put forth the effort to uh, whatever form work, paperwork, documentation, hoops, application forms, calls, emails, in-person visits, whatever, they require of you to to do well do them yes i know that takes time and you'd rather do other things and you wish somebody would just do that for you but nobody's going to do it for you you have to do for you you have to keep after what's important to you 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 keep after your 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 right so Give that idea some thought. You will feel a lot better if you put this stuff on your list and focus on it and go through whatever effort is necessary to get it. I know it's tough to do it. I know you don't want to, but you will feel better when it, when it's accomplished. All for now.